We work for uh, UTEP football continues even on this beautiful Sunday. The Miners are out on Glory Field running, hitting, throwing and sweating as they prepare for the 2022 season. One of those players working to take their game to the next level is Trent Thompson. The senior tight end looks to build off his great 2021 season. He was UTEP's primary tight end target last year. Thompson racked up 133 receiving yards and four touchdowns. This year he hopes to top those numbers and help the team win along the way. The product out of Houston, Texas is ready for another season to show up and show out. I believe I could uh, score some more touchdowns and make some more physical pancake blocks in my opinion. I want to be the best player I could be and see what the future holds for me because I've done this for, this is going to be my fifth season and I just want to see how far I can get. He's one of the most important guys on our football team. He brings so much to the team and he's one of our very, very best players on the team. At his position, he's one of the top, top, top guys that we have and uh, he's an outstanding blocker and very can catch the ball well when he gets his opportunities. Now, remember, Thompson was the player that had that 51-yard score against Fresno State in the New Mexico Bowl last year. Will we see more of that this season? We will have to wait and see. The Miners open up the season August 27th against North Texas. That is 19 days away, and one of the big questions we are still waiting for an answer for is what is going to happen with linebacker Breon Hayward? Remember, the Miners are awaiting an appeal for an extra year of eligibility for Hayward. He's been at practices just watching. Head coach Dana Dimmel told KTS earlier this week he wasn't interested in discussing Hayward's status for now all the miners and Hayward can do is wait until they hear from the NCAA the season opener is less than three weeks away